I'm out on Lake Wawasee in Syracuse, Indiana. I'm taking a look at the JC line of pontoon boats. This is the 25 Sport Tune. Join me back at the docks. We'll take a good look. JC Pontoon builds the Sport Tune 25 TT with lots of room to customize your particular model to the way you like to use it. They know that their customers appreciate the flexibility and reliability of the JC pontoons, which are built with the convenience to cruise, relax, and enjoy the whole day in luxurious comfort. The main entry into the spacious bow seating area is through the wide double gate. JC Pontoon uses stainless steel for the docking lights, oversized cleat ice, and rails. Corner pods are currently fiberglass, but JC is working towards converting to using composites which are more eco-friendly. These pods have handy tip-out storage boxes, small cargo net storage below, with stainless steel cup holder in the side, and storage inside through a side access door. Captain's chairs at the bow are one of the many options you can choose on this model. These comfortable high-back plush seats will have you relaxing in the sun. The height adjustable snack table is made of durable starboard material and has a lip to keep things from rolling off and two stainless steel drink holders for beverages. JC uses multiple lounger end combinations so you can customize the layout. This lounger has two stainless drink holders in the top, a fixed angle back and a tip out trash bin. I appreciate how they used a gasket to dampen any potential rattle. These loungers have rotocast seat bases with hinge cushions and an excellent storage space. Two more entry gates are located to starboard and port near the midway of the deck. Moving aft, the Sportune has a large L-shaped bench seating area. The end capped on this lounger has two stainless steel cup holders, fixed angle back, and a 36-quart carry-on cooler nested in the side. Even with a snack table in place, there's plenty of space to store gear. The standard bimini top features polished aluminum bows and stun umbrella canvas. Side railings are powder coated and even the bimini fittings are stainless steel. Anytime you need to get to the wiring, you'll love this flip-up helm. This really gives you maximum room to operate. You can keep your wallet and cell phone stored in the nearly invisible dash box. The leg room at the helm is awesome, even for a six-footer like myself. The tilt wood wheel and accents on the dash match and add elegant feel to this functional dash. Lighted rocker switches with push-button circuit breakers are at your fingertips to the left and right of the wheel. BD gauges are across the top of the dash. A Hummingbird Matrix 727 is standard with this model, but our test boat was upgraded to the Color 787 model. Below the switches on the right side is a standard Clarion AM FM CD stereo with free Sirius satellite service included for six months. The pad across the stern lifts up to reveal a huge storage bin. The unique stern light sets up very quickly. Behind the helm is a two fender rack to keep your fenders in order. The aft entry door leads you out to the outboard style dual swim platform with concealed telescoping ladder under the starboard side. Our 25 Sport Team was powered with 225 horsepower four stroke from Honda. Honda's BF225 four-stroke is a flagship of this series with high-performance efficient workhorses. It is the same engine as Honda Automotive uses in the Odyssey and Pilot. Air induction on the BF225 is a two-stage system pulling fresh air from the top and running through long intakes to a butterfly that opens at 4,000 RPM, ensuring the proper air for low speeds as well as high-speed performance. A belt-driven 90-amp alternator ensures plenty of charge for the electronics aboard. It delivers a powerful jolt of 60 amps to the battery, ensuring a good charge with power left over for everything else. Lean burn feedback on the BF225 will save you about 20% on fuel cost over many of its competitive models. The Sportune 25TT measures 25 feet length overall with a beam width of 8 feet 6 inches. She weighs 2,150 pounds without the engine and carries 55 gallons of fuel. Now we've had a chance to look at the features of the 25 Sport Tune. Let's see how she runs with a 225 horsepower four-stroke from Honda on the back. I tested the 25 Sun Tune TT on Lake Wawasee in Syracuse, Indiana. Conditions were perfect for a leisurely drive. Her most economical cruise speed was reached at 16.2 miles per hour for a range of 259 miles. Equipped with a 225 horsepower Honda four-stroke engine, she hit a top speed of 38.8 miles per hour, turning 5,570 RPM. With JC Pontoon's 25 Sport Tune, you get a lot more space on board for your friends and family, and you get a lot more performance. She really does handle very well, and with the 225 Honda four-stroke on the back, she's got the performance you need.